Welcome back guys, it's me, Jessica Styles, coming at you with another late video from my bipolar brain, late at night. I'm sorry, but today's video is just going to be a little catch up video on some of the things that have happened while I've been away. Um, so basically like a little vlog. The first part of the vlog is me and my friend Terry going on yard sales. She is the number one yard sale queen. I shit you not, I shit you not. You gotta get you a friend like her because she will sit out the night before, she puts that all down on a piece of paper, writes down all the yard sales that we're gonna be hitting that day, what time they're at, she puts them in her phone, in the GPS, and we're off. We start at the beginning of the day and we're not done to like two or three and she's so good at controlling herself too. I have, I go and be spending like $50 a Saturday and she'd be like, I spent four bucks, I spent three bucks, I got you this for free, I got you this for free. This was actually a $1 fine at our last yard sale haul so that's kind of cute. It's a little skirt that goes along with it and don't forget about the socks the socks the dirty stinking socks there's some foot content for you slots. anyway so let's watch that little part oh it looks like they're loading it up the last time oh, those guys are like for fuck's sakes these bitches are we up. too late yeah we're too late <laughs> all right <laughs> thanks Damn it, but you said no. <laughs> nope. This is what a hard work garage sale looks like. <laughs> <laughs> Then we stopped at a place that's just kind of like off the beaten path of the town, like not too far. But it is the cutest, cutest mom and pop shop, ice cream shop thing. It is, it's got the weirdest stuff. It's like a hoarder's dreamland of like antiques and like things and I love it. And there's ice cream and just weird things. So we checked it out, watch. I know, this is like my kind of place, you know, like look at all this stuff, look at all this stuff, oh my god, this is like my favorite place in the world, I think, I'm just gonna have to come here to look at all this stuff. I used to have one of those. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, old school washing machine too. You put your clothes in there and you have to like dance and then when you want to bring your done, you bring it through there and then it goes like that and you would squish the water out. Wow. Isn't it beautiful? I never actually been in here before. That's so cool. Seriously, it's gorgeous. Then you know your girl made a TikTok haul about all the wonderful, magical, witchy items that I acquired on my uh, yard sale uh, adventure because it's an adventure and a half. Like, who gives away a free whale tail? 
quail, not for quail. But gives away that shit for free. Oh Some cool witchy yard still finds. Wooden flute. Wooden dancing mat. Feathers. Ocean bottles. The guy selling the cards was selling tons of occult items and used to do paranormal investigations. We played around with some things, got to know each other, and exchanged information. Thanks for watching. And of course, a much, much, much needed sub funded pedicure because we gotta keep these beautiful toes sparkling for those foot subs. Sorry, they're dirty, but they love it. I decided to put my skills to work and start muddying the holes my children's and dogs have created in the house. I'm feeling the effects of masculinity right now. I feel the testosterone. I wanna go to war! I want a lightsaber! I'm a man! War! Get this seatbelt off of me! But <laughs> in the end, I'll show you. So that worked out. I fucked it up right away. They didn't fuck it up right away. They, they, they seen, oh, mom made a brand new white patch for me to dig my crayons and pens and markers just into, just do get into this and it into dug the little. I am doing a YouTube video. Another, another flex has been my uh, gym goings. Um, I have been just busting it at the gym. I, the last couple days I've been flanking a little bit, but I've been, I've been working hard. So like, I'm, I'm, I'm a bit of flex, okay? I'm, 
I'm about to flex. Okay, okay. Like, like, who is she? Who is she? And that's just like a little bit. That's nothing yet. So, I don't know. To me, like, oh, I just love it. So here's a little clip of me working out, being the hot bitch that I am. One thing I have been struggling with though is eating properly or eating at all. So I have, I guess, trigger warnings, suppose, eating disorder, I guess it would be. I don't know. I'm not diagnosed or anything, but I just, I don't eat all day and then I eat supper and then I'll snack a little bit at night and then I won't eat all day. I'll basically like starve myself, which isn't good for your body plus I work out. So I've been trying to eat breakfast, lunch, snacks, high protein stuff, especially since I'm lifting, all that extra stuff. I've been trying, I've been trying. And I love me some avocado. mom to the rescue again <laughs> I love it though I do but the kids they come home with this little bird who has this plastic wrap like wrapped around his little little leg and his legs are like messed up and like out and like it's like not moving it's like falling off And like, you, I, I, so I had like slowly cut and unravel this stuff from this poor bird. Luckily, we were able to get all of it off. Mm -hmm. 
Um, I was able to clean his wounds. I was able to put some disinfectant on it. Uh, he stayed with us overnight. and then went off to the vet. He sent him away to a wildlife rescue facility in Winnipeg. So hopefully they were able to rehabilitate him. They haven't kept me updated. I'm staying hopeful that he has been re rehabilitated. It, it, it so sad, that poor bird. I hate that, I hate that. Like, I just, I hate it. My daughter actually brought me a bumblebee the other day that was sprayed with candy spray from a kid at the park and she wanted me to save this bumblebee. So I'm like washing this bumblebee with water and I just, I don't know how to, animal rescue, we're back at it again, but I just, I don't know what I'm doing. I just want you to say like this, I don't know what I'm doing. The morning after, I'm standing outside having my morning coffee, pretending I'm on my cruise, sipping my drink, looking at the beautiful ocean. Then what fucking wanders by my feet? The baby mouse, this one in there, walked by my feet and went in there. Oh my God, hi baby. Hey, little baby mouse. He's still, he's still a baby. Oh my god. You're the tiniest little mouse ever. You weren't even scared to walk right by my feet. Hi, little mousey. Oh my god, you're freaking adorable. Just eating something in there. there. What are you eating in there, little guy? <laughs> what little tiny, cute little animal just in front of my feet? A mouse. Yeah. Let me repeat that. A mouse. A baby one. So, he's cute. He's not even scared of me. He's just a baby. He's not even scared. So, my God, my God, I can't, I can't kill it. Because it's just a baby. But I need it to be away from my home. 
so we capture them when I get the kids to set them free down the block. Hopefully they live with his cousins in some dumpster somewhere. And last but at least, I got some merch um, available soon. Like, I got a friend of mine who got, okay, my friend of mine, Terry, the one I was yard sailing with, you know, Terry. Um, she Twitch streams as X6Ruby9X. Well, her friend who she streams with, Grim, she does digital art design. And I asked if she wouldn't mind doing some of my spicy work art design because I wanted a few stickers made up and stuff like that. And some prints for t-shirts. And yeah, I got a I got three off of her. And I, I want to get a couple more done from a few different creators. So if you know anybody or have any mind, please drop it in the comments. I would love to check out your work. Um, 18 plus, please, because it is adult related, adult content, some of it. Um, just for safety. Um, but yeah, so I made a little TikTok here open in of one of the, one of the, photos that she did for me and it's what girl alrighty guys that's it for today's video vlog thank you for staying this long if you have thank you for being a part of my little community i'm growing i'm sorry i'm going to try to be better i'm getting my setup set up a little bit better trying to give myself more space trying not to overdo myself um but then again i like i like started a twitch channel too so i'm streaming on there as well uh, i don't know why i'm holding my pit stipper but I am. Uh, uh, now I have to get ready to do some spicy OF content since they haven't kicked the sluts off. Yes. Alright. I love you. Thank you for tuning in. Oh, I broke a nail. I forgot to mention. Like snapped her off. It was hurting so much. It was bleeding. Yeah. Drop a like. Drop a comment. Follow. Share. Subscribe. Everything. You know you want to see me. The more you bug me about it, the more I'm going to be on. So, follow, follow, follow. Give me all the attention so I, I come back. I'm going to dance me. Bye, my son.